everybody. Tim Pretty here, and I got my grandson Anthony Mullins with me here. Hello. Mullen is here. Thank you. So he's going to help me with a story, and it's a story by Eileen Spinelli, and it's called Thankful. And as we're in the Thanksgiving season and Christmas season, it's a great time to reflect on being thankful. So we're going to start, but it starts with the scripture. Here's the scripture right here. It says, it comes from Psalm 107, verse 1. It says, give thanks to the Lord for he is good. His love endures forever. Then we're going to start right here. So, Anthony, go ahead. The gardener. Wow. The gardener's thankful for every green sprout. Mm -hmm. The fireman for putting out the fire up. And what's the other one? The, the poet is thankful for words that run. The children for for morning story time. The artist is thankful for color and light. Mm -hmm. The clown for her costume, silly and bright. The doctor is thankful when patients get well. The traveler for a cozy hotel. The dancer is thankful. She loves she loves the beat that that stirs her heart and hips and feet. The chef is thankful for plates licked clean. The sailor for her for her sewing machine, sewing machine. Taylor. Taylor. Yeah. Okay. The queen is thankful for. Afternoon tea. The beekeeper for honeybees for for the honeybees. The mayor thankful for every vote. The sailor for his sturdy boat the bird is thankful to list a new bird and the pastor is thankful for God's loving word the Crafter is thankful for glitter and glue. Supplies. And me, I'm ever so thankful. For you. Great story. Great time to be thankful. So what are you thankful for, Anthony? Hmm. I'm thankful that we are... Um, here on Sunday talking about stuff that we're thankful for. Yeah, well, that's cool. And I'm thankful for all those people who have been a blessing to me. Let's have a prayer. Do you want to say a prayer or do you want me to say a prayer? Do you want me to say a prayer? Okay. All right. Dear God, we are thankful. Everything that we have, it comes from you. 
Help us to always keep that in mind as we share all those many blessings you've given us. We ask you to lift up all those youngsters and their parents and grandparents that are in our congregation and are in the world and that you help us all be ever mindful of those who have been blessings to us. We ask all this in Jesus' name. Amen. All right, guys. We'll see you later. Bye. Bye-bye.